Installation instructions to install Luxiflex Evo pivot awnings. The following instructions apply to all forms of Evo installation using a head box. Open the head box front cover by unscrewing the bottom front screw on the head box end cap. Repeat on the opposite side. Pull out the idle end locking pin and remove the roller tube idle end first. For reveal fit, the screw is not required to be refitted to secure the front cover in place as a clip is installed in the head box to lock into place. Drill the head box back plate. Always secure the head box back panel through the installation bracket or spreader plate. If there are no substantial fixing points at the ends of the head box, a spreader plate can be added. It can also be used on awnings over 3.5 metres wide as an additional centre fixing point. First check the overall height against the order and mark accordingly. Determine the centre of the head box over the opening. Position the head box. Check the level. Install the head box. With a crank control, insert the crank gear pin end of the roller into the crank gear. Insert pivot pin into idle end of the tube, ensuring that the rubber O-ring is located into the second groove on the pin. Lift roller over the installation bracket and down, so pivot pin sits inside the pivot plate. Insert the idle locking pin to secure the roller. To determine the fixing position of the arm, measure the arm length from the top of the arm to the centre of the bottom fixing hole plus 40 millimetres and transpose this measurement from the bottom of the head box to determine where to fit the arm. Install pivot arms using appropriate fixings. Do not stand directly in front of arms whilst doing this as the pivot arms have a high tension spring and injury can occur if the arm is accidentally released before being securely attached. Arms should be positioned within 500 millimetres of the ends of the bottom rail. Ensure the arms are perpendicular before securing the arm brackets to the nuts on the bottom rail. Check the operation of the awning. Insert the head box front panel and snap into reveal clips or attach screws to secure. For pivot arm reveal installations, the awning should be ordered with extended bottom rail and an angle bracket should also be ordered. This will provide a face to which the pivot arm can be mounted. The location of the angle bracket can be determined using the previous process. The installation is now complete. Ensure you show the customer how to operate the awning and provide them with their warranty document which is in the packaging.